Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the oiliest, hideous skin covered entirely in foundation of my life. So, <laughs> this video, um, I don't actually know how long it's going to be. I am going to be trying to sort my skin out because it is absolutely horrendous. I have been trying every cleanser, every spot cream, every solution, blah, blah, blah. I don't have a high hormone intake. Um, I have the coil if you guys are wondering. Mm. Um, but I do have a generalized anxiety disorder, depression. I am bare stressed, always stressed. Um, I don't sleep well. I don't drink enough water. My diet's probably not the best. So obviously that all doesn't help with my skin. So I went up with the doctors today, it is the 9th of January, um, and basically he gave me this um, gel once daily, I cannot say what's actually in it, there's like peroxide in it, um, Duoc, I think, spot acne cream stuff to use, um, use once daily as directed, see the enclosed leaflet, so I have to use this at night, um, and I assume there might be like bleach or something in it, that will obviously uh, stain on my pillow sheets, which I'm not very happy with, but I'll just wear a towel, it's fine. Um, yeah, basically, um, I'm gonna try stick to the same skincare routine, if I can, like removing wise as well, every day, um, this is meant to last me for two months, um, so currently, oh my god, my arms are heavy, it was long, camera long. So currently, I am using the Lush Angels on Bare Skin Cleanser um, in the morning and in the evening, which you will see in a minute anyway. Oh no, flashing battery one. Hello, and we're back. Fantastic. Oh, that's really annoying. So, um, I don't know what I was saying. Um, yes, the cleanser I also have been using to remove my makeup, um, rather than just uh, micellar water. Um, I've been using the Body Shop Chamomile Gentle cleansing balm that's what it is um for all my face and then for my eyes because i do have sensitive um eyes and i wear contact lenses um i just use my cellar water i then use a toner which is the lush um rose aroma water toner um basically i did try the pixie glow tonic and my god i feel like it broke me out even more um i will insert pictures anyway very horrible my skin hasn't been this bad in ages and yeah that is that obviously i think eating a lot a lot of chocolate over the christmas period as well isn't helping so basically i need to stop eating chocolate i need to drink more water i need to eat more veg and fruit even though there's a lot of sugar in fruit isn't there um ish natural natural though um i need to sleep i need to do this and hopefully this is gonna help me as well I don't know i hope this video doesn't come like across like oh wow well, if you just you know drink more water and do this and do that i used to and my skin still never cleared up oh pardon me um yeah so i don't know but i'm gonna give it a go i'll see how this goes oh i've done it again inform you in the morning um but yes i'm just gonna go remove my makeup and apply this e and we shall be updated Okay, so that is me cleansing my skin. Look at that. Got a nice one on the nose, smashing bare blackheads. Wow. Gee, 
what a way for like insecurity and uh, self-confidence hmm? great um it is probably my fault like i said at the start with the whole like diet not drinking enough water not doing this not doing that chocolate i love the chocolate but i am gonna sort it out i am just gonna use some micellar water to take off my mascara however <laughs> i do actually have the benefit bad girl bang mascara on and my god it is one of the hardest mascaras to get off like literally um so i made struggle i don't know if you're gonna be able to see this would be pretty cool if you can let me just try and hey look at that Now I just need to not move. So I take four cotton buds, pads, two for my toner, two for my eyes. I'll literally just pour it on, pop that there, and I don't know if you can see. Oh no! But it'll just be easier to hold. It'll be easier to hold now. Oh my god, that's so close. You do not want that. Oh no, wrong way, wrong way. Help me. <laughs> yeah, so I'm just initially. Oh, it's really good for your lashes, mascara. Like, look how nice it is. But it is a bitch to get off. I'm literally using my viewfinder as my mirror. <laughs> Obviously, this spot cream, I've been advised to be on it for two months. I hope it bloody lasts two months, because I'm going to smother it everywhere, because I am a head to yours. Can I just, oh my god, how good does that brow look, can I just say? My brows never look that good. Normally it looks like that. Awful. Fab. <laughs> I'm just going to pop some eyeliner on the other one. I just want to say as well, I know some people's acne can be a lot worse. Than this um i've always had it i don't actually have pictures back in the day um but i've never ever had clear skin i've always had blackheads i am disgusting i need to get one of them tools to sort it out i do want to go to a dermatologist i want to do everything because i'm so self-conscious in my skin i wear like so much makeup to cover it um, the makeup I wore earlier actually was the Makeup Revolution. Oh my god, what is it called? I don't know what it's called, but basically it's the concealer one. Define and conceal foundation. There you go. Um, amazing. Thoroughly, thoroughly liked it. I think I only put like two layers on, oh, which is bad. I know, but when you're spotty and you need to cover up yeah so i'm definitely obviously not getting an early night tonight i'm just gonna try to why am i trying to do this there we go <laughs> winner winner chicken dinner why am i trying to do this like here why have i not fought through okay then i'm gonna go over with my toner Jesus Christ, I need a new camera. Um, I basically oh, smother the cotton pad and I just go over my skin. This is really nice, it has actually helped recently. Um, I found it again, um, calmed down my skin. So when it was really bad the first couple of days with the Pixie toner, I used this and my God, like all the redness was just going, which was amazing. Um. Ew. I have got my moisturiser again which is by Lush which I have been trying out it's the en Enzyme Enzymion I can't pronounce it, which is so annoying, I'm sorry, but yeah, this is what I am using. Use on the face in gentle upward strokes, it's great for oily skin when under makeup, because this cream helps keep overprotection of oil at bay, which means makeup has better staying power on the skin. 
unfortunately I still get oily with it but I'm trying it out I don't expect amazing things straight away um, with any product I use that's unfortunately how I uh, how I live so I'm trying not to like exfoliate like over exfoliate sorry um Oh, I'm literally because I'm not sleeping well as well, which obviously doesn't help. I'm staying awake till like gone 4 a.m. Just YouTubing all these videos about skin, and it's very strange and silly. And yeah, I don't know. Right, I'm just gonna read this quickly to make sure. Probably should have read it before I put my moisturizer on, but there was no way I'm not moisturizing because if this is going to dry me out. I want it sorted. Completely remove any makeup, wash the affected area of skin well, then rinse with warm water and gently pat dry. Put a thin film of gel on the entire area of affected skin using your fingertips. Apply to all of the areas of your skin which have acne, not just the individual spots. If the gel does not rub into your skin easily, you're using too much. Ooh. For your face only, use the amount of gel from the tube which reaches from the tip of your finger to the first joint of the first crease on your finger. Damn, this is a fingertip. For your face and back, use two and a half fingertips. If you get a lot of dryness or skin peeling, you can use an oil free, fragrance free, hypoallergenic moisturizer. Uh, use Duac once daily gel, less frequently, or stop treatment for a short period to allow your skin to adjust to the treatment. This medication may not work properly if it is not applied every day. Wash your hands after using the gel. After it has dried, you can use a non greasy makeup. After it has dried, you can use a non-greasy makeup. I don't understand what that means. Um, yeah. Wow. Oh my god, side effects, right? <laughs> Signs of an allergic reaction, such as swelling of your face, eyes, lips or tongue, nettle rash or difficulty breathing, collapse, severe or prolonged diarrhea, or abdominal cramps, severe burning, peeling or itching, uh, great okay so i am going to try this then so basically i'm just gonna put it everywhere aren't i because that is how bad my skin is god it's not really a nice smell there isn't that much bye there isn't that much in it can you just stand up because I'm trying to sort my life out and you're not helping. 30 grams. Okay. So, but then I suppose if it's... Oh my god. <laughs> Jeez, this is going to be a lot. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm just going to... Right. Please don't burn. Please don't burn. Definitely should have put my hair up for doing this. You know when they said a thin layer? <laughs> Oops. Right, I'm just going to use this mirror quickly just to double check. I'll tell you what, that thin layer was alright. So, it's all sunken in. My face is a little bit tacky still. Um, and basically, I went all like down here as far well as you can see. I've got <laughs> quite a few. Um, even in like my hairline and stuff, it's just bloody horrendous okay it has properly like sunken in now it still feels a little bit but i wonder if anything will happen like overnight wise i'll be very interested so on that note this is it oh i need to see what time it is quickly so it is now midnight woo it's now the 10th of january hello <laughs> um so i i'm gonna try to sleep maybe in about an hour or something i've just taken an antidepressant 
cool um and that's apparently meant to make me tired so i am yeah i will update you if like i don't sleep because i've been struggling lately if not yeah so um that be sorted i'll speak to you in the morning guys morning <laughs> um so ooh, day one using the cream um it is currently 10 past nine in the morning um oh, i didn't go back to like <laughs> maybe half two three three o'clock maybe yeah not good um very quickly because my camera's flashing um it left my skin really soft this morning and like now um all i used was the lush cleanser um and yeah not bad not bad happy so far hello <laughs> i haven't actually done an update for like a couple of days um but later on tonight i am going to show you my skin today is exactly a week of using the um acting cream i have got low batteries so i'm gonna be quite quick this is what my skin looks like with makeup on just thought I'd show you so yeah hello hello <laughs> please excuse the most hideous appearance but it is currently the <clears throat> 25th of January I think it's been two weeks or something now that I've been taking using the cream just an update My forehead is like so clear now, like it hasn't been this clear since when I was like 10, I'm not even kidding. My battery is flashing, I do need to change it, but just a quick update. Yes, I'm so happy. <laughs> Hello, it's the 9th of March, like evening, and this is like an update. Like, I think I've used a makeup product. <laughs> Right, so it is the 11th of March. I have been using the spot cream for January. Oh my god, I haven't even been using it for like three months. Was it two months or three months? I think three months, but I literally have the tiniest amount left to use, so I don't know. I can't actually remember how long. I think it was three months, so I was meant to obviously have it. Um, so this is currently my face. I think I've done something with my forehead which you saw a couple of nights ago. Um, so sad. Um, please excuse my greasy hair, I need to dry shampoo it. Um, yeah, basically this is my situation at the moment. I think I'm going to ring up the doctors either this week or next week and get another one of like the tubes. I sort of want it to be done now. <laughs> I don't know. So that's all I've got at the moment. I will obviously update you guys if i get another spot cream and then hopefully however long it takes and then we've literally got like another month to go i think is that right so january to february is one month february to march is two months yeah and then march to april so i've got like another month to go but i need another tube so it's another eight pounds something on the prescription great <laughs> but can't complain it's helping so that is my situation currently Hello, so this is going to be like maybe the last overview. I look awful. I am not very well today um, and I'm filming on my phone quickly. So I apologise if like it's really bad and I look like an egg and it's really good. Yeah, so I'm just going to do like another, excuse my makeup. 
overview. So it is currently the 17th of April. Um, I am quite happy with how my skin is now. As you can see, I do still have these little buggers, which don't really want to go. I didn't actually use the cream last night, which was bad. I had a very late night and feel very sick and very ill. So that's why this is happening. But if you sort of compare to what happened when I first had like the reaction and stuff, um and then like the first few weeks of trying the cream like it it was 10 times worse than this so I am really happy overall I do think it is really really gonna clear up like eventually um but I just think obviously I've still got to wait um and I will still keep repatching it I should look hideous sorry <laughs> um so yeah I will see still keep obviously repatching it um on prescription until basically it all goes um but I'm really 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 impressed with it it's finally something that works also um skincare wise I will do like an updated skincare routine um very soon because I know quite a few people are asking but just for preference very quickly um to wash my face or like to take my makeup off I use the number seven radiant results revitalizing hot cloth cleanser um first and then sometimes I doesn't always get my makeup off so then I go in with the lush angels on bare skin which does help take your makeup off and it is a facial cleanser as well and then lately just to finally cleanse which might be too over the top but it really is helping what I've um, noticed like for a few times now. I've only used it maybe not even five times yet. And it's the Mario um, Badescu or Badescu, um Acne Facial Cleanser. This is very good. Um, this is really helping me actually literally in the space of like not even five five washes <laughs> um so i'm really impressed with that and i definitely am seeing like a little difference sorry my hands really shaky i'm using the back end of my phone rather than the front front so very difficult um but yeah i will do an updated skincare routine if you guys are interested because i use toners and eye makeup removers and everything like that so um yeah if you are interested um, give this video a thumbs up um, just so I know and also leave a comment down below so that's really interesting but if you've got any other um, questions or queries or anything please leave them in the comments below and if you would like maybe in like three months time a really updated like skincare not necessarily skincare but like spot situation routine video let me know and I will of course do that as well so um yeah I'm gonna end this video I hope you enjoyed it Ew. <laughs> if you did please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe I will see you in a brand new video soon guys bye